My next guest is Gavin Newton Tanzer, president of Campus 360, one of the lead exhibitors here at NACAC 2021. Thank you mm -hmm. for being here, Gavin. Mm -hmm. um, you are here with a mission. Your family. Mm -hmm. yeah, this is a repeat performance for mm -hmm. you, right? What is the value of being mm -hmm. here at this organization with this organization mm -hmm. and what it does for Campus 360? Because this is your yeah. family and your audience. Yeah, no, we uh, love coming back on each year to a different city, each year a different destination, and connecting with um, both communities. And in some ways, we actually think of it as sort of the university community as well as the counselor community. And we like to do everything we can to make sure they stay connected. So it's not just uh, while we're here at the event, though that's very important, it's also when the universities ultimately want to invite those counselors onto campus or ultimately uh, bring those students onto campus. And, and that's what we're here to do. Yeah. And so we're, we're doing the very best we can to create every possible tool um, and stay on top of the, the tech trends. Uh, so that the counselors can focus on engaging the students, the universities and can focus on engaging um, and connecting and showing off the very best things they can do. Um, and we make that as easy and smooth as possible. And you know, let's talk about mm -hmm. those tech trends because yeah. as you think about uh, mm -hmm. this year, mm -hmm. Everybody yeah. is right here exactly. on this phone, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So how is technology in your area mm -hmm. leading change? Yeah, uh, so leading change is the theme, and it's something that we've always deeply believed in um, and are doing our best to impart to what has always been a very traditional uh, space. So it's still very much getting students into classrooms, and, and that's been the modality until uh, basically COVID, where people are realizing and adapting sort of online learning, online engagement, and it really changed things in a big way. Um, so we do that in a couple of different ways. Um, many people are, are just starting to become comfortable, but with like virtual reality um, is one of the most common themes that we've been promoting. And it's become extremely popular now where an individual through a tablet, a computer, but of course a VR headset, which you can now get off the shelf for a couple hundred dollars, um, enables you to have full live experiences in a classroom or immersed with other people or even visiting a campus. So, I mean, I remember when I was 14 years old traveling around the country going, and that was terrific, um, but in a socially distanced world or uh, when it's maybe not as easy or Can't of course, do that now. <laughs> and, or even financially challenging for exactly. some people to maybe get around, um, this enables everyone to have that experience. Or for, on the other side of things, um, for a generation of students that is growing up with Roblox, Fortnite, Minecraft, um, and, and uh, Pokemon Go. Uh, I'm sure many people have heard of these things, are familiar with these things, but don't really understand sort of where, where's the tie-in to what that means. It's, it's not the games, it's the medium. And it's about how can we, uh, the key word we talk about now is like the metaverse. How can we bring a physical experience and add that digital component into it? And so that's where AR technology comes into place. And we've been working on that augmented reality so that any sort of a uh, flyer, a brochure, anything that's sent in the mail that students receive can tell them something or make them feel something because it can come alive in a unique way. Um, and so that's, uh, we've been really focusing on, okay, how do we take the, the, the technologies, the mediums that the students are used to and are expecting and educate uh, universities such that they can actually harness that as well. Um, and so, yeah, that's, I think we're going to see more and more of these sort of hybrid digital environments as time goes on. Yeah, it's the wave of the future. Mm -hmm. And thank you for leading that change here mm -hmm. at NACAC mm -hmm. 2021. We awesome. appreciate you being here. We'll see you thank next you. year. Thank you. We're excited. In Houston. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you very much.